King me. I don't want to play anymore. The pain. I can't live like this, Brian. I need you to pull the plug. Well, I, I, I can't. I, I... Be my angel and set me free. Please. Those are my first additions, you little punk. <gasps> Mama, Doggy is scary. Brian, have you lost your mind? He's just a baby. He doesn't know what he's doing. This isn't over. Oh, if you're looking for your Dostoevsky, I used it to make the fault from F Troop. Look what I found, Stewie. An appointment card. You've got a checkup. Oh, marvelous. A quick way in to stick out your tongue and a nice lollipop to cap it all off. Peter, I have a bad feeling about this man. He's not the kind of person I want hanging around our family. Honey, you're overreacting. Will you please just listen to me for once? That man is bad news. I want him out of our house and out of our lives. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, Lois. Look, I'm just going to give you a little something to help you relax. Now! Okay. It's been two months, Armando. You're putting me in a real awkward position here. Oh, please, Senor Griffin. Just one more week. I will pay you double. Perhaps we can work out another arrangement. Oh, please, Senor. Not my beloved. Armando, Armando. It is for the children. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yes, mio. Yes. I... Yes. <laughs> Come. I, uh, got you a little something. Y you know, for the show. It's Italian. <laughs> Do you like it? Oh, it's exquisite. I it's not for every day. Well, clearly. I'm gonna put it on right now. Well, I'd say the men's club inaugural ball is a huge success. Hey, guys, let's play a party game. Let's go stand over near Brian, and we'll take a drink every time he says bonerific. Ownerific? Yeah, it's his catchphrase. He says it all the time. Yeah, sure, okay. I'm here. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> you know, uh, I was really glad you sent me the book. I won't lie to you, I came this close to praying that I'd see you again. Good thing you didn't, because who, who would, would hear, hear it, it, right? right? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Can I interest you folks in some of our heavenly cheesecake? No, but I'll have some of your there's no afterlife souffle. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, thank you. Well, come on. I really wish he would. It'd be so great if we were at least living together. Well, you need to just lay it on the line with him. Either he commits to you or you're gone. What the hell did you do? Because of what you said, Jillian wants us to move in together. Well, I think you should, Brian. She's beautiful, she's funny, and she is smart as the day is wide. Do you like cake? Yes. Do you like my ass? Yes. Do you want to eat cake off my ass? What kind of cake? Angel food cake. Well, Rusty, looks like we're going to eat our way out of another jam. All right, get your snacks and hurry out, you guys. Yeah, look, they have chunky bars. What a god-awful mess those things are. Chocolate with raisins in it. Yeah, yeah, that's what kids want with their chocolate. Fruit. Why don't you put sunflower seeds in the ding-dongs while you're at it? Is that part of your stand-up act? I don't know. Do you like it? I wouldn't open with it. Drink this, honey. It'll bring your fever down. I'm gonna go run you a cool bath. <laughs> She's one of them. I'm sure of it. Now tell me what they injected me with. Huh. Do you know Mr. T always wanted to be a Broadway dancer? Answer me, damn it! What have they done to me? All right, look, it could be any number of things. Gene manipulation, sterilization, it could... Not my seed! I have so much fun when we hang out, Lois. And I love your hair. We should make up a name for your hair color. We could call it, like, like, Strawberry Sunset or Ginger Maiden. Or, 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 or one of those hair color names that's a random noun, like, like, Temptress. <gasps> oh, at some point you have to let me braid it! Lois, what are you doing? Ah! Oh, yeah! Oh my god. Whatever happened to forgive and forget? Oh, you just want Cleveland out of the picture so you can get back with Carolyn. You know, Brian, sometimes I don't believe I know you. That, that's not it at all. I, I happen to think Loretta is very beautiful with her sassy wisdom and speed bag arm fat. Hmm. Hey, Lois, what you reading? A red badge of courage. Huh. I sure wish I could meet a brave fella like the guy in this book. 
you know, uh, I'm a brave guy, Lois. Oh, yeah? I bet you're not brave enough to laugh at death. Watch me. <laughs> oh, thanks. Like I don't have enough trouble fitting in. She's gone. Jillian's gone. Look, Brian, I know you're upset now, but I think it's important to see things in perspective. Remember when Alex P. Keaton lost his girlfriend? And then he got another one and everything was all right? And then he got Parkinson's. Yikes. You know, Stewie, you're right. Th th this is not a loss. It's an opportunity. All right, wait here, Stewie, while Mommy gets the cement blocks. <gasps> Everything all right here? Oh, fine, officer. Just uh, enjoying the sunset. No law against that, is there? What happened to your shirt? Oh, you know, <laughs> just a pizza party at the office. Oh, yeah? Where do you work? First Fidelity Insurance over on Way Bossett Street. Oh, my cousin Arnie works over there. Oh, Arnie's your cousin, is he? And that's the story of Pretoria, a little nation that 200 years ago seceded and repatriated in less than a week. Any questions? Yeah, uh, I, I don't get it, so... Like, can the family understand the baby, or, or, or what, what's the deal with that? Oh, Chris, in a few minutes, you'll become a smart, successful Jewish man. I could make a foreskin joke right now, but this is a solemn occasion. And besides, there'll be plenty of time for that on the ride back. Oh, I got so many of them, too. I, I know, I know. Shh, shh, shh. But later. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the Quahog Oil Refinery, we would like to thank Mayor Lois Griffin for our newest waste pipe. <laughs> Let the dumping resume. Jolly Farm is on, Stewie. Don't you want to watch? Oh, the Stewie who loved Jolly Farm is dead, Megan. Meet the Stewie who loves funky fruit hats. <laughs> oh, turn it up. Mom and Dad are on. Hey, we're back here with more Kiss Forum. I'm here with the Griffins, and they got something really exciting to share. Yeah, my wife here did kiss. Get it. Come on, your dad deserves another chance. Wow, you are smart. All right. <laughs> No, oh, no, no, it's not all right. I'm out of cash. Hey, you take bank cards? Sure. Can I get stamps, too? Stewie, did Mr. Jackson behave inappropriately toward you? Well, yes, but the worst part was he never called back. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, in all seriousness, yeah, he was actually pretty aggressive. <laughs>